Alberton School. I hope you're having a really good week. I want to welcome you back to another bite sized workout. I've come back to Yapton Free Church and it still feels a little bit like my home, but though I've been out and about doing a few more things as we all have been. Today I have four fitness tests for you and we are going to find out who is the fittest, me or you. I did hear a little rumour this week that Leo Luton's in year four did the most star jumps in his class. Whether or not that's true, I'm not sure, but we're going to find out today. So the four fitness tests that we are going to do are how many star jumps can you do in a minute? We're then going to see how many press-ups you can do in a minute. We are also going to see how many squats and sit-ups you can do in a minute. Okay? So that's star jumps, press-ups, squats and sit-ups. Each for one minute. Count how many you can do and why don't you see if you can beat me. But to start with, let's get warmed up. So let's go down to our toes and back up and stretching up for me, guys. I'm still really looking forward to a haircut. I haven't booked it yet, but it's going to come soon. Come on. Okay, and then let's go out wide and down. And wide and down. There we go. Come on, Warburton. Okay, and let's do a little bit of jogging on the spot. Just to get ourselves warm. Okay, so we're going to go in about 20 seconds for our first exercise, okay? The first one is going to be star jumps. We're going to go for one minute, see how many you can do, and see if you can beat me. Okay, 10 seconds. Get yourselves ready, guys. In five, four, three, two, one. Let's go. Come on. I'm at 20, what are you at? There's the 30. Super strong today, 
you can do them stretched out like that, okay? And again, it's how many you can do in one minute. We're just going to wait for my time and get to an even number, otherwise I'll lose track of where we are. And three, two, one, let's go. Come on, Wilberton. Come on. I like to do these in groups of about however many I can do at a time, have a short break, and then go again. 20 seconds, guys. Come on, keep going. 15, 15 seconds. I lost count on the seconds before. <laughs> Come on, 10, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. Really good job, guys. How many did you manage? I managed about 35, which isn't quite where I want to be. But you've got to set yourself targets and goals. When I was at college, about 10 years ago, I used to be able to do 60 in a minute, that's a press up a second. And I definitely can't do that now. <laughs> so, okay, we are going to go for some sit-ups. So we want our legs looking a bit like that, we're going to go down, and we're going to curl up, okay? We've got about 10 seconds, and then we're going to go for it. But before we do that, who's looking forward to Easter? How many of you have seen the Easter eggs in the shots. Okay, I'm ready. Three, two, one, let's go. And how many of you have chosen your favourite Easter egg? I saw Easter eggs coming out a few days after Christmas this year. It really surprised me. One of my biggest weaknesses is sweets. I just love chocolate. Well, to be really honest, if you want to have any kind of food. <laughs> they refer to me as the dustbin at home. The amount of food I eat. But that's because I stay physically active and I'm doing a lot of things. Come on, Walton! 15 seconds! Okay, and there you go. And if you do a lot of physical activity, a little bit like a car needs fuel to keep it running, your body needs fuel to keep it running as well. And because I do a lot of work, outdoors, practical things, or drumming, or fitness, I have to eat quite a bit to keep my body running. But if I didn't do as much, I would probably need to eat a little bit less. And that's the thing, make sure what you eat is in proportion often to the amount of exercise that you're doing to stay fit and healthy. Anyway, Walton, I hope you've enjoyed those fitness tests. To be really honest with you, I didn't count the amount of squats I did or sit-ups I did. I managed about 70 star jumps and about 35 press-ups in a minute each. If you've done that, or see how many you can do, and maybe next time, in a few weeks, See if you can do a few more. I look forward to seeing you soon, and I've got another one of these workouts coming soon. But have a good week, Wolverton, and I'll see you soon. Bye-bye!